happening YouTube we're back again today with another video dad out here trying to get the Tahoe looking good took it to a car wash about two weeks ago I'm the one explaining it because I'm the one that took it to the car wash and I don't know what happened you know they say don't take your, your newer cars to car washes and stuff but uh, apparently one of the brushes had uh, scratched the surface on it or something like that See the little scratches in it. Did some damages to the clear coat. Clear coat is still messed up. We're gonna see if we can, we're gonna see if we can buffer it out. But we're gonna try and see if the compound works, but you know. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna see if we can buff this out here too. So just pray that it comes out because if you don't, <laughs> this is one of our this is the, that we don't even drive that much, but I still want to look good, so I'm gonna try to do what I can to get this thing to buff out, see if I can buff out the scratch. If not, then I'm gonna have to strip the clear coat and re-clear it. So let's just hope that we can get it buffed out. And you know it's a shame because uh, these uh car washes they don't take any uh responsibility for it. You know, exactly. they have signs up saying, you know, it is a you know, something happens, they're not responsible for it. So it ain't too much that we could do about it. I mean, if there is something that, that we could do about it, I mean, we don't know anything about it. You drop it, uh, comments down below letting us know. But when he gets through washing this off because we want to make sure the surface is clean before we start anything, he's going to dry it off. And I'll show y'all a little bit <clears throat> more close up view of exactly what's going on with it. But yeah, that was the first and probably the last time taking this car to uh, automatic car wash like that especially with it being black everything just shows up in the paint so if you can try to wash your cars by hand in your driveway or take it somewhere where they wash it by hand because uh i mean those uh those uh little brushes and stuff yeah but i was in a hurry but uh, I think those brushes they pick up like little rocks and dirt and stuff like that off of each car or I don't know how it gets on there but they pass it on to the next car or whatever and then they just start scratching and stuff on the paint and I mean as it dries up it looks worse so we're going to try to put a little compound on there as you can see there's a rock chip right there um, I think y'all can see that. But probably for that, we can just get some uh, touch-up paint and cover that up. But as far as this right here, I mean, that looks pretty bad. I don't think any touch-up paint's gonna fix that. I mean, I'm not a paint car guy. He's more of the, you know, knowing what's going on with paint and stuff like that but i just know it looks bad so i'm gonna try to take care of it today and see what we can do By the way, guys, this is a 2015 Chevy Tahoe black and color, as you can see. Um, got this truck in 2014, so it's fairly new. Doesn't have, I think it has uh, around 40 something thousand miles on it. Yeah. So as you can tell, we don't drive it much, but when we do, we like for it to look pretty good. Yeah. You don't wanna let that dry up. $50,000 truck looking like that. So we want to make sure it's looking pretty good. Especially with it being that new. I mean, just look at that. I mean, the camera just doesn't do it justice, but yeah, it doesn't look too good. Here it is again. Once again, YouTube, this is what it looked like. I don't know if the camera can catch all the detail of, but this is what it looked like after running it through one of those automatic car washes. So I always tell my sons, you know, 
hand wash your stuff because this is the result of when you run through the automatic car washes. So it don't did some clear damage on here. So I might end up, if I can't buff this out, I'm gonna have to end up re-sanding it and re-clearing it on a 2015 Tahoe. And that's really not a good thing to be doing that on a 2015 Tahoe, but hey, it is what it is. So I'm gonna cut you off YouTube. We're gonna uh, get right back with you in a few. Let me get this started. Okay, YouTube, we're back. We uh, get ready to try to buff this out. Uh, we put wax on there. I uh, hope it's not a little too heavy, but I'm gonna rub it out here real good. And by the way, y'all, the uh, buffer that he's using is a black and decker. Black and decker. Hold on, stop, stop, stop. Yeah. Show that for y'all. Well, you can see I'm starting off on number two. I'm gonna start off on number two, not too fast, you know. I don't want to sling it everywhere. So we can back it down, we can start off on number two. And we're gonna rub this out real good. I'm just a part of it. So everybody just cross your fingers and hope that this works because... <clears throat> Basically, you see this side over here, this is the before versus this side over here, which is after the compound. And um, I mean, we made uh, pretty good progress with this, but uh, I mean, you can tell that the clear coat 
it's got a pretty good amount of damage in it. I don't know if it's uh, a thin clear coat that uh, GM puts on their trucks or, I mean, I don't know what it is, but I guess we're gonna have to do some uh, clear coat uh, work on it. See what happens with that. Uh, how would you guys handle this situation if uh, this is your car? Took it to the car wash. This happened. They're saying that uh, you know they don't have any. Uh, they're not responsible for any damages to your car. Which, you know, I guess I understand that. But uh, if you were to take this to an auto body shop and have them fix it or a paint shop or whatever. Uh, how much would this job cost? And do you feel comfortable paying for that? Or, you know, do you just say, well, I shouldn't have did that. I won't take it again. I'll pay for it. Or do you think that someone else should be held responsible for the way, I mean, your pain is looking? Because either way, it's gonna cost some money to get this fixed. But we're gonna continue to try some, uh, other things to see if that works out and uh we'll catch up back with y'all in a little bit Picked pick this up from uh, advanced auto parts store because i heard that it was supposed to be uh pretty good uh, especially for what we're dealing with actually it did a pretty good job it just couldn't get out the real real tough uh scratches that were in it from the brushes uh at the car wash but I mean, if you wanna check this stuff out, if you don't have any like real issues with your paint, I definitely recommend it because as you can see, you can see yourself in the paint. Uh, but <clears throat> yeah, give this, give this a try if you don't have any uh, deep, deep scratches in your paint and uh, see if that works for you. Okay, YouTube, we are back and this is a result of some section that was uh buffed out with uh some compound then i try a little wax on it uh this is the result that we came out with <clears throat> maybe you can see it in the camera uh it do look a little better but we do have some deep scratches in there so i'm, uh, I'm gonna come back and try to get some wax and grease remove and clean it off real good and uh, i mean but it looks better than that over there but yeah it's still uh yeah so uh then I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna try to hit it with some uh, 2,000 maybe, uh, 3,000 sandpaper, cause I don't actually want to sand the clear off of it if that's not the problem, you know? So I'm gonna try to sand those scratches out of there and then I'll go back and try to rebuff it again. But I'm gonna have to clean it up real quick, get this wax off of here. Because you can see that we still have scratches down in the clear here. Yeah, I don't think it went down to the paint. I think it just actually down in the clear, so. I'm gonna try to hit with some real fine sanding paper and take those scratches out and then I come back and buff it out again, you know. But if, 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 if none of that solution works, then I definitely gonna have to sand it and re-clear it. So that, that could be the end result of a, a sanding and re-clearing. But right now I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some uh, real fine sandpaper to try to I mean, sand these uh, scratches out of here and hopefully that'll work. Let it save me some uh, some time and labor and some money <laughs> and money, yes, of course, and money. I mean, you don't want to spend a lot of money on something if you don't have to. But like I said, this is uh, one of my main vehicles, and I I want to keep it up. So I don't know. And if you know, the sad thing with this is that <clears throat> this is a car that we don't drive every day. It's not a daily driver. Um, it's not a garage car but uh it's very well kept so for it to be looking like this you know we're a little bit heartbroken <laughs> to say the least um yeah so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and make this a part one and then once we uh, get it sand down and do some more stuff with it try to get it looking better than what it is because it is gonna look better than what it is we're not gonna leave it like this then we'll come back with part two and uh show you guys how we finished out, you know, everything to get the final result. Uh, we're just gonna have faith that it's gonna turn out right. Uh, Cause pretty much, uh, I mean, really, we can't stay like that. 
So like, comment, share the video, subscribe. Uh, if you watch this far, you might as well go and subscribe anyway. It's no need of watching the video and don't subscribe to this content because we're gonna have plenty of it coming back. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and, you got anything to say? Yes, uh, just stay tuned YouTube because we are gonna have more contents for you uh, on, our, on our car vlogging channel. Uh, this channel is, is basically about what we do for cars, painting and uh, waxing, washing. Uh, we, we, we are gonna have more content. Well, not only painting, other stuff too. Yeah, that's what I said. I said uh, we're gonna do, you know, not only painting. We, 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 this is our car. It's gonna be channel. a variety of things. It's gonna be a cover. variety of things yeah. with, with great content. So just stay tuned to that. Uh, we got more coming. And those of you that are new to this channel, you know, uh, don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, and don't forget to turn on your notification bell, you know, for the next upload of the videos. Uh, so you will have a heads up that we did upload another video. Uh, try to get this video video to at least 20 likes finish this out uh just 20 likes that'll do it and uh we know we're gonna hit y'all with some more content so yeah hey youtube we're gonna go ahead and catch up with y'all later all right bye